E-Safety is a new qualification from the Institute that's been designed specifically for students at Key Stage 3 and 4 to help improve standards of online safety. Hello, my name is Kate Edwin Scott and I'm Marketing Director here at BCS, the Chartered Institute for IT. The outcome of the qualification is that learners can protect themselves online, they can report safety issues and behave responsibly while on the internet. 49% of children now have access to the internet in their own bedroom, which increases the risks of cyberbullying, exploitation, reputation and privacy issues. Ultimately, we're trying to change online behaviour here, and as a parent of young children myself, I welcome that. Since the Byron Review, eSafety has been taught as part of the national curriculum for personal wellbeing, citizenship, ICT and Every Child Matters. It offers practical hands-on solutions to the common issues and risks of using the internet. Teachers are already teaching internet safety as part of the national curriculum. We've developed a complete learning solution that will make that teaching easier. It can be used off the shelf or to supplement existing materials. The key differentiator is that it has an online test which gives students something tangible for their achievement and gives the school essential evidence for school inspectors. I'm here at Swindon Academy, part of the United Learning Trust. They're one of the early adopters of our new eSafety qualification. The United Learning Trust particularly values the qualification as a crucial element of online safety. The United Learning Trust is an academy sponsor uh, within England, currently sponsoring 20, over 20 schools. My name is James Garnett and I take a strategic lead for eSafety within the United Learning Trust. Uh, we've embraced the eSafety qualification from the Chartered Institute for IT because it enables to hang the work we currently do on eSafety within a framework that gives us a qualification which we haven't had in the past. This differs from traditional methods partly because it has a qualification at the end of it but also it doesn't just cover what we think of as traditional elements of e-safety such as stranger danger but also goes into looking at things like browser settings, how to set your cookies on your PC and also pick up Facebook settings. It's important to verify the e-safety curriculum because we now have over a third of teenagers using mobile phones with internet access, they've got internet access in their bedrooms and we need to make sure that they are, have access to e-safety teaching and e-safety curriculum that enables them to stay safe when using these technologies. This e-safety qualification enables schools to demonstrate to school inspectors they take e-safety very seriously. The learning materials are fantastic. They allow for teachers to um, facilitate the class, especially if we use any non-specialist ICT teachers. It gives good, strong materials for the class to interact with. The um, activities are varied and different. There's worksheets, there's um, the PowerPoints are brilliant to use. We can transfer those and use them in different ways with different age groups. The materials in particular are quite flexible, so we can change them and adapt them to maybe what's happening in the outside world to look at sort of if there's been incidents in the news, you can then bring that into the materials. Okay, the year groups that are going to be taking this e-safety qualification are going to range from, we'd like to do something with our year 7s and 8s, but mainly at the moment it's going to be year 9s and 10s. Have you talked to your dad about it? Yeah, yeah? a lot. Okay, and he's explained all, to your dad all about the course that you're doing at yeah. the moment. Okay, what does he think about it? Well, he's starting to let me use his computer more because okay. you know he's starting to realise that I know more about internet safety. Okay, and have you been explaining to him how to stay safe? Yeah. yeah? You've been demonstrating to him the things that you've learned. Yeah, I've set his account settings to private already. Well done. So you're teaching your dad as well, yeah. aren't you? The qualification is flexible and meets the needs of each school. The test part of the package can be set by pupils who are learning from other sources and then the Chartered Institute test verifies that there has been an understanding of the e-safety syllabus. It takes 30 minutes to complete and takes students who are a randomised set of multiple choice questions and then a further set of real scenario questions. Results are instant, validated by the Chartered Institute and a certificate is issued to successful students. E-safety is very easy to implement. It consists of three parts, complete learning materials, e-learning and an automated test. So how can the Institute's e-safety help your school? It saves you time by offering a complete learning solution. It provides essential evidence to verify learning. And it keeps you up to date with the latest developments in internet safety. If you want to offer this qualification, contact our client services team.